Hello everyone, welcome back to NASCAR 07 here for race number 18 of the season. And officially, welcome to the halfway point. It's the USG Sheetrock 400 at Chicagoland Speedway. Uh, if you didn't watch the last episode, it was a pretty hard battle at Daytona actually. Kind of the complete opposite of what happened at the 500 where we just kind of took the lead and ran away with it. Uh, and it did come down to basically the wire. Uh, but yeah, if you didn't watch the last episode, go do that right now. Let's go into spoilers. So, Jeff Gordon, still the points leader with a massive gap over Brett Biffle, even bigger towards Jimmy Johnson. Uh, Tony Stewart uh, finished pretty bad at Daytona. Uh, definitely didn't have involvement in that. Uh, definitely wasn't my fault. Um, and Kevin Harvick, ourselves, Dale Jr., Kurt Busch, Ryan Newman, and Elliot Sadler. Uh, now, he DNF'd at Daytona, which put him actually pretty close to 11th in points, which is Mark Martin, and just by extension, Dale Jarrett as well. So, if Elliot Sandler continues to have bad weekends, it is very possible that at least the temp spot could change. Uh, other people that are fucked, uh, JJ Yaley, he's not doing anything. <laughs> so yeah, uh, Chicago Land Speedway. It is an intermediate race rank, which... You know what that means. Things are gonna run like garbage, probably. Uh, but, as that being said, let's go to the track. So yeah, um, welcome to Chicago Land Speedway. Uh, this is the one racetrack that people always say, Hey, Nick Chen should go back here, and man, do I agree with that. The only thing I don't agree with is that people say you should replace the Chicago Street course, which... Personally, I think they should just be able to coexist. They're like completely different things entirely. Like, do we really need a two Richmonds or two Phoenixes? Do we even need one Phoenix? That actually should be demolished. The uh, Chicago Land is another intermediate, which is. Concerning because that's the only track night that we don't have pace at. And I don't know how to fix that. It, it, it's just really fucking annoying. I can have pace at Daytona, I can have pace at Bristol, I can have pace at any other racetrack, but as soon as we come to one of these mile and a half or two mile racetracks, it's just nothing. There's nothing here. Uh, as being said, uh, let's get to the race itself so we can salvage anything. I think the only good uh, thing about qualifying here is that I'm uh, on the inside. It doesn't matter because I accidentally shifted down because I thought I was going to start in like third. Uh, oops. I guess. So yeah, welcome to Chicago land. Uh, it's the one race that I really wish they went back to. I mean, the only thing the next gen is good at is intermediates and two road courses and super speedways, so maybe we should add more of those. Uh, bumping out the way. I mean, I said we didn't have pace and intermediates. I think, I think we're actually pretty okay here. Please turn, okay. Uh, 198 car almost shot my nose. So to kill himself. Yeah, Jimmy McMurray, uh, I have a problem with you. Body? Yes. Fuck you. Fuck you again.
Wait. I think in real life, people do kind of say that Chicago Land isn't that good. But I think I think that's more recency bias than anything, considering the last few years of Chicago Land was the 550 package. That surely doesn't help. But I think this track is at its moment. It's good. It's I just uh, wish uh, could have both this and Chicago Street Cars because I think that is also one of the best tracks in the schedule. Come on, Tony. Fun fact, this is the only time that Jeff Gordon has ever won at Chicagoland in real life, though. Uh, can he repeat history, or can he win Chicagoland in any other video game? Guess we'll find out. Not looking very promising, considering he's tumbling like a rock. Sorry, Tony. I lose. Sorry, Jeff, I got glued into your car because you passed the fucking s Gorilla Glue on your car. Oh, I didn't want to go three wide. I didn't want to do that. I panicked myself into sending it in that corner. Greg, can you not? Greg. Rag. Thanks. Uh, shout out to Dale Jarrett. Bo is about 150 years old and he's still running up front. Oh, shit. Can I bump him past Jimmy? Go, yeah. Dale. Now I'm gonna take the lead because uh fuck you. Actually, no, uh, lead this lamp and then I'll tap pass. Oh, that's not an apron. Why am I spinning? That's a tri oval. You're supposed to run down there. Oh, uh, that's annoying. It's gonna cook my tires. Because, of course. Suffering! Agony! Kyle Bush! Can I. Can I have some fucking room, Kyle? Idiot. Nope. We got some cars with fresh rubber behind us. What do you mean? Why would you pit now? Why would you pit now? What is this strategy idea? It did the thing again where it's just really loose off the corner. I'm just gonna drive as Tony for this restart and then, uh, yeah. Wow, look at this car that turns. Incredible. Why can't I have that? Well, my car, Joe Gibbs. Oh, sorry, Jeff. Actually, that's your fault for fucking chopping my nose. Alright, Danny, can you just uh, block them? Thanks. There's my debris caution. Oh, I'm the debris caution. 
But not Mark. Are they gonna put... Nope. I'm not even controlling Hamlin. I'm still getting fucked on research. Man, this is annoying. There's another debris caution. It is Dale Jr. Not pitting. Not, where's Yaley at? Oh, that, that was literally instantaneous. We didn't even go green yet, man. Not pitting. Kind of hear what I am. Oh, my God. Oh, sorry, Greg. What the fuck was that? Like an hyperspeed debris. I was about to lose two spots. I wasn't even controlling Yaley that time. It is literally just because I'm like driving as him or something. That's your fucking fault, Mikey. <laughs> Yeah, then you flip your dick off. Good job, Mikey. Oh my gosh, what happened? It looks like it's about to be the shortest episode of all time just because the AI are morons. Fucking hell, man. Fucking. Oh my god. Fucking lord, man. Oh my god. <laughs> Why is it NASCAR black flagging people for putting debris on the track? Why is this happening? Fuck on. You know what? No. What the fuck? What was that? I didn't even turn yet. Yeah, okay. Oh, jeez. I know older tires, but what the fuck is that? Good job, Kyle. Moron. Good camera angle, Fox Sports. Ah! I, I guess I'm pitting fine. Yeah. What, what, what do you mean half the field? That would not mean I'm last. Let me guess. More debris cautions, right? Yeah. Why is Yaley up here? Why? Oh my god. Oh, tempers are flaring at Chicago. That, that is literally your fault, Mikey. That, that. Suspend this guy? Ban him? You're banned out of string for the rest of your life. That guy's lost his fucking mind. He's fucking insane. Tempers are flaring. I mean, Michael Ultra is pissed at Yaley, and Hal Bush is pissed at me, and then someone is pissed at Tony Stewart, probably. Everybody hates Joe Gibbs Racing. Can I somehow get anywhere near the front? Fuck. Oh, safer barrier. Uh, 
one of you needs to go. One of you needs to hit the fucking gangs, dude. Uh, preferably you, Strammy. Prefer okay. I was fully expecting Strammy to fucking put me in the wall. He's trying. It's really. Strammy! Good fucking lord, man. I, uh, I got the hint to never run the fucking top at, in NASCAR 07. Because idiotic AI and idiotic drivers do not know that you exist. Alright, Tony's leading. Huge. Yeah, you get out of the way. What are you doing? What are you doing, 111 car? Man, I really don't need another restart, but man, do I want to turn this guy. I'll bring a brick. That is not how physics works. What the hell is that? Mm, I don't think so. Why is Casey pissed at me? I didn't even... I have not seen you on the track once. Come on, we can, we can talk it out, right? Just don't... God. Yeah, d get out of here. No, I said get out of here. Oh, Dale Jarrett is leading again. Robbie, please, don't do that. Yeah, everything's great, actually. The car turns really well, somehow. It might be the best car I've ever had in an intermediate. Or, I guess they call it cookie cutters back then. They gave them intermediates a new term. Um, I don't want to be on the top. Actually, especially with these two fucking idiots. Oh, huge switchback. Yeah. Man, Tony Stewart is really up out here denying Dale Jarrett from taking his possibly last career victory. It's going to be an unpopular win for Tony. But I could be pissed at you, Jamie. You're a bitch. Oh, J Dale Jarrett's leading again. It's gonna come down to the wire, probably. My shared draft range of Joe Nimichon. Jimmy Johnson now is leading. Wish I could see that, but like, too blurry. I think Jimmy is way clear, and then Tony's on the bottom right now. What do you mean, rival? I literally helped you. Th that was. I mean, it was a bump mid corner, but like, it helped you. Why are you pissed? Uh, I'm gonna be so able to salvage a top 10 out of this, which is impressive. Especially after everything that's happened. Ooh, okay. Don't do it, cancel. Okay, we're clear. Uh, white flag, Jimmy Johnson leads. Correct me if I'm wrong, has he even won a race this season? I don't remember him doing so. 
Uncle Tony, uh... Nah, Jim B. Johnson's gonna win. Good lord, man. What was that? Alright, well, uh, let's get the results. Uh, yeah, so Jimmy Johnson wins, Tony Stewart second, Dale Jarrett third. That's a great run for him. Uh, Ryan Newman fourth, Kevin Hart fifth, Mark Martin sixth, Greg Biffle, Jeff Gordon, Dale Jr., and barely <laughs> ourselves. Uh, yeah, Matt Kenseth, uh, Kurt Busch. I just want to see, where did the bitch finish? Here's your like 23rd, Kyle Busch, 24th. That's all you fucking get. Tonight's biggest loser is David Shremmy. Ooh. Dude, average speed was 85 miles per hour. How many cautions we have? This being said, uh, let's go to... See what that does for the points. So, yeah. point standings. Uh, Jeff Gordon still leads uh, with a smaller gap to Greg Biffle and then Jimmy Johnson. Uh, Tony Stewart. They all close up the gap. I guess, I guess Jeff Gordon did run kind of eh. Uh, Kevin Harvick, ourselves, Dale Jr., Ryan Newman, Kurt Busch, El Sadler, and Dale Jarrett is within 20 points of Sadler, so chances are we could see Dale Jarrett in the chase, or Mark. Uh, I think Kenseth's gonna be a little too far off. Uh, Yaley gained a place, good for him. Uh, um. I mean, Reed Sorensen could be overtaken by Blaney to be the worst driver this year. Uh, yeah, so... I guess I'll do it for Chicago Land. Uh, I'll do it for this episode. Uh, next time out, we're going to New Hampshire. A track that... Oh my god, I hate it. It is... I, I don't think there's a single NASCAR game where New Hampshire is a good track in. But who knows, maybe NASCAR 07 is the one game that has a good New Hampshire. I have... I never driven it here. So... Yeah. Thank you for watching. Like the video. Subscribe. All that. And... See you next time. Goodbye.